Throughout the ages, it's been the deepest cry of the human heart to see God. Lifeline Audio Dramas presents Can Anyone See God? Almost ready? Yes, ma'am. Mama? Yes? I have a question. Timmy, you know how I love your questions, but we're running late. It's really important. I understand, but let's talk about it later. Oh, here. Let me fix your tie. Um, well, well how's that? I don't want to hurt your feelings, Mama. Oh? But Daddy was really good at ties. I know. Sometimes I wish I could have one more day just to play catch or go fishing. It's hard. I think what I miss most is when he would hug me. He would hold me tight, and all that made me sad would go away. Oh, Timmy. Mr. Wiseheart said he'd be happy to take you fishing first thing Monday morning. I'd like that. Mm. Ah, there. I think I got it right. You look so handsome. Thank you. Come on now, we don't want to be late. Looks like we just made it. Ah. All right. Mama, I really need to know. Need to know? At Sunday school, Miss Beckman said God was a great person. He is. Well, I'd like to see him, Mama. Can you help me? That's my question. Can I see God? Oh, I, I wish I could tell you. But I don't know. I'm just getting to know him myself. Tell you what, why don't you ask Miss Beckman? Okay, I will. And that is the story of the Good Samaritan. Any questions? Yes, ma'am. I have a question. Timmy? Miss Beckman, can I see God? Can you? Well, that, that's quite a question. Let's you and I talk about that one after Sunday school, all right? Yes, ma'am. I asked my mama, and she told me to ask you. Well, uh, that's, that's a little too deep for me. I think Pastor Taylor is much more qualified to answer. After all, he went to seminary to study such things. Why don't you ask him? Okay, I will. Timmy, come on and sit here on the pew. Thank you, Pastor Taylor. <sighs> Mama's waiting in the car. She wanted us to be able to talk man to man. Oh, well, thank you for waiting. So what's this about? I want to ask you a question. I asked my Mama, and I asked Miss Beckman, but they couldn't answer me. Oh? So I'm coming to you. Here's my question. Can I see God? Well, that's a tough question. But the answer is pretty simple. No, Timmy. No man can see God. Not until we're in heaven. Oh. God is just like the air. You know he's there, but no, you can't see him. But he's real, just like the Bible says. Oh, very much so. So why can't I see him? That's just the way it is, son. It's the test of our faith. Believing in what we can't see yet. So, no, God is not to be seen. Not until heaven. Thank you for letting me know. Well, 
Did Pastor Taylor answer your question? Yes, ma'am. You seem awful quiet. I'm just thinking. What did he say? He said no. No man can see God. You sound very disappointed. Yes, ma'am. You know God loves you, right? I do, but I don't want to just read about him and sing about him. I want to see him. What's going on? Who's there? It's me, Timmy. What, what, what time is it? Timmy, it's 5.30, son. I thought you wanted to start early. Well, I did say early, but... Oh. All right, all right. That boy. Timmy? Good morning, Mr. Wiseheart. You said we could go fishing this morning, and you'd show me the best fishing spot on the whole Ohio River. Go get the gear from the shack. Yes, sir! I'll meet you by the boat after QT. QT? Right after my quiet time. Heavenly Father, I love you. Thank you for this day. I ask that you would guide us through whatever lies ahead. That sun, won't you? Peeking up over the ridge. I love how the sun wakes up the day. The feel of those gentle, warm rays on your skin in the morning. Yeah. Now right up there, that's Six Mile Island. And off to your right is that little cove I told you about. It's about a mile from this shore to that shore. You ready? Yes, sir. Well then, here we go. Best fishing spot on the whole Ohio River. Thanks for taking me fishing, Mr. Wiseheart. You're welcome, son. <laughs> well, now, looky here. That's a good day's catch. Sure is. What you looking at? Nothing, just thinking, I guess. Let me ask you something. Yes, sir? You missing your daddy? Yes, sir. I am. Your daddy was a good man. He died standing up for what's right. That's what Mama told me. Oh, I'll be glad when this war's over. Mr. Weishart? Hmm? Why aren't you married? Why isn't there anybody to care for you? Oh, Timmy, there's... Someone who takes care of me? So don't you worry none. Hmm. Is there something wrong? Them clouds don't look too friendly. Timmy, we're fixing to get ourselves a storm. Looks like the kind that blows up in a hurry. Are we gonna be okay? If we can make it to shore in time, grab those oars. Let's pull together. Yes, sir. Let's go. Come on. 
Come on! You can do this! Keep going, son! And... Man! Well, Paul's here until the storm passes. <coughs> you okay? Yes, sir. We made it. We sure did. Thank you, God. So, uh, you asked about why I wasn't married? Yes, sir. It's because my wife is in heaven, waiting for me. Oh, just like Daddy's waiting for me. That's right. But we have a promise we shall meet again. I sure do miss her, though. Yeah, I miss Daddy, too. is my favorite time on the river, right after a rain. When the water washes all the dirt off the trees and they look so pretty and green, fresh, and the flowers seem to pop out, especially pretty after a rain. See that? I do. Now take a deep breath. <sighs> Nothing like the fragrance of wild roses. It's just like the Holy Spirit, like a shower from heaven, washing away fears and doubts and the sweet fragrance of his presence filling our souls. <sighs> Mr. Weishart, what is it? Are you all right? Why are you crying? <laughs> look, <laughs> look behind you. <gasps> Rainbow. Just pause and drink in God's beauty. <gasps> Mr. Weisert? <laughs> what is it, lad? I gotta ask you a question. All right. It's something Mama and my Sunday school teacher and even Pastor Taylor couldn't answer. Sounds like a mighty big question. If God is so great, can anyone see him? Come here, son. God bless your little heart. All I've seen for the past 50 years has been God. You've seen him? The more God you have on the inside, you can't help but see him on the outside. You just gotta keep your eyes and your heart open to him. And sure enough, you'll see him. Really? Really. If you look, you can see him in the sunrise we saw this morning. You can hear him in the power of the storm this afternoon. And just look at him in the beauty of that rainbow. Wow! Yes! I see! I can see him! Hmm. Son. I saw God today! We can see him, Mama! We really can! You've been listening to Lifeline Audio Dramas. Can anyone see God? <laughs>